as I was on location filming the soon to be released production entitled Leprovision, I was able on two occasions to take a tour inside of this Freemason temple, and I went twice because this is no ordinary run-of-the-mill Freemason lodge. It's the Masonic temple of the Scottish Rite of Freemasonry, which is the only rite of Freemasonry which confers upon its worthy initiates the highest degree of Freemasonry, which is the 33rd degree. Now, just to give you an idea of how unique this Freemason temple is, listen closely to what one of the female employees told me there as she gave me a tour. So by Mother Unanimous Act of Congress was passed that allowed Pike's remains to be exhumed, and now he is also buried behind this bust. So by unanimous act of Congress, the revered 33rd degree Freemason Albert Pike, the author of the book Morals and Dogma, which is revered as the Bible of Freemason ideology, had his remains exhumed, meaning they were dug up, and they are now buried behind this statue of his likeness inside of this Freemason temple. Now that was just to give you an idea of how unique this Freemason temple is. Now, listen closely to what this 32nd degree Freemason told me as he gave me a tour around the temple. All right, an order of chaos, order out of chaos. An order of chaos, order out of chaos. So notice, within this shrine is a stained glass window with the words Ordo Ab Chao, which means order out of chaos. And there is pictured a very distinct link design on this stained glass window, which is directly associated with the Freemason concept of chaos. Uh, so the face of Medusa represents uh, chaos and a lack of knowledge. You know, the snakes is chaotic. And then she's surrounded by depictions of the four the face of Medusa represents uh, chaos and a lack of knowledge. You know, the snakes is chaotic. So this very distinct chain link design which is seen on the left and the face of Medusa which you can see pictured on the right. Both of these are symbols used within Freemasonry to portray the occult concepts of chaos and a lack of knowledge. And both of these occult Freemason symbols have been compounded together to give you the logo for the very expensive celebrity-driven Versace clothing line. Whether they know it or not, the majority of the largest celebrities in our world have been turned into billboards to display these occult symbols of chaos and a lack of knowledge. And to punctuate the significance of this symbolism, their music and their movies actually glamorize chaos, vanity, and ignorance. By the way, another word for chaos is confusion, and another word for confusion is Babylon. Do you think that's a coincidence? Listen, the Bible tells us in the book of Revelation chapter 14 and verse 8, and the second angel followed saying, Babylon is fallen, is fallen, that great city, because she hath made all nations drink of the wine of the wrath of her fornication. Then in Revelation chapter 18 and verse 4, concerning this great city Babylon, God himself says, come out of her, my people that ye be not partakers of her sins, and that ye receive not her plagues. I'm warning you, it's time to wake up and stop following the tenets, the ideologies, the deceptions of Babylon, and to stand as one that has been made in the image of God before it's eternally too late. God is trying to deliver us from the mirror of deceptions which are blanketing our world, and the only way you can do this is if your life is hidden in the truth. And Jesus said in the book of John chapter 8 and verse 32, And ye shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. And as always, this is the forerunner, and whether you like it or not, the truth is the truth.